Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. In this video, I'm going to discuss the example for optimization problems. A piece of wire of length 240cm is bent into the shape as shown in the diagram. So means that in here we have the info. We have to add on the situation where we have A to B is equals to 13x plus B to D where we have Y plus D to E where we have 24x plus E to C where we have Y and finally C to A where we have 13x. So kindly simplify the situation and we will have 240 equals to we have 13x plus 24x plus 13x. So finally, we have 50x plus with 2y. Simplify the situation. 120 is equal to 25x plus y. Kindly refers to the situation. Express y in terms of x where we have y is equal to 120 minus 25x and show that the area A enclosed by the wire is given by A is equal to 2880x minus 540x squared. So next what we have to do is to find the area. So kindly focus on the diagram. And we have two partition and we have the midpoint and we name it as 12 X so based on the situation we name this part as M where we have the midpoint so now what we have to do is to find the a M by using the Pythagoras theorem where we have 13 X bracket square equals to 12x bracket square plus with the a m bracket square so kindly expand the situation and we will have 169x square is equals to 144x square plus with the a m square rewrite the situation a m square is equals to 169x square minus with 144x square. So finally, the AM square is equals to 25x square. And the AM is equals to 5x. So in order to find the area, 1 over 2 multiply with 24x multiply with the AM, where we have 5x plus with the situation twenty four x multiply with the y so rewrite the situation where we have a is equals to twelve x multiply with the five x and we will have sixty x square plus we have twenty four x y Kindly substitute the y, which is 120 minus 25x. So a will be equals to 60x squared plus with 24x multiply with 120 minus 25x. So kindly expand the situation. a is equals to 60x squared plus 2880x minus 600x squared a is equals to 2880x minus with 540x squared and we have shown the situation for area next kindly focus on the second part find the value of x and y which a is maximum and hence find the maximum area second step is to 
find the first derivative and follow by the second derivative where we have dA dx is equal to 2880 minus 1080 x after we differentiate with respect to x so the second derivative is equal to negative 1080 after we differentiate the situation with respect to x the third step is to find the critical value or the problems where we have dA dx is equal to 0. Kindly substitute the situation and we will have 1080x is equal to 2880. So x will be equal to 2880 divided by 1080. So x will be equal to 8 over 3. Next, step number 4, test the value. So kindly substitute the situation into the second derivative. So means that when x is equal to 8 over 3 and the second derivative will show the value negative 1080 where we have less than 0. So it shows that x equals to 8 over 3 is a maximum value. So the question asks us to find the value of x and y. So kindly refers to the situation where we have y is equal to 120 minus 25x. So kindly substitute x equals to 8 over 3. So y will be equal to 120 minus 25 multiply with 8 over 3. So the value of y will be equal to 160 over 3 or you may express your answer 53 1 over 3 next the question asks us to find the maximum area so kindly substitute the value of x which is 8 over 3 into the first part so a will be equals to 2880 multiply with 8 over 3 minus with 540 multiply with 8 over 3 squared and the value of a or the area would be 3840 cm square thank you so much for watching this video if you think the video is useful kindly consider to like comment share and subscribe